Hey everybody, Ben here from the Bonehead Podcast, and we've got something very cool today. I love it when Charlie Victor sends us stuff to have a look at, because the stuff is always great, and today's great stuff. We are going to be having a look at not one, but two dice cups. So of their dice cup range, they do a black one, they do a yellow one, and we are going to have a look at both of them today. So the dice cups are available on the official Charlie Victor website. I'll put the link in the comments below. But uh, what we're looking at today is the official Charlie Victor dice cup and mat. Now, it comes in two different colors, one design, but two colors. So we've got the black color and we've got the yellow color. And we are going to be having a look at absolutely both of them. Now, these are, um, I mean, to be fair, they do a great job putting what they are in the description. As far as Blood Bowl is concerned, these are dice cups. And one great thing about using dice cups for Blood Bowl is the well, two things really. One is that you can absolutely guarantee randomization. Okay, we've all played against those players who just kind of drop the dice onto the table, um, which then causes another problem. And that's the, the second great point here is that when you are rolling dice and putting them on the mat, they stay on the mat. If you just kind of free ball the dice across the table, they could. And if you've watched the Bonehead Championship, you probably see that every now and again, the dice do take out certain players. Ian Warhanam Hanam, I'm looking at you. Every time we play a game, you throw your dice at my dudes and I will hold it against you forever. Anyway, these stop that from happening. They make sure that you roll them properly and they actually tend to stay exactly where you want them to go, which helps keep the table tidy and it keeps the randomization good to go. So this is two of the designs. So uh, da -da 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 -da, produced in PU leather, it features a debossed colored logo to the front, debossed logo to the base and a black uh, and a back, black logo printed on the inside over the smooth valet interior all finished with detailed stitching now we're going to have a look with the overhead cam in a second to really show it off but that's exactly right i mean we've got the logo on the middle you can probably see that the green screen's interacting with the yellow quite nicely so that's good uh, the dice mat is also produced in pu leather and features a debossed stamp logo and color stitching to help dampen those big roll blows so the mat goes over the top means you can put it down you've got it on the table and you're good to go uh, the cup is 90 millimeters tall and 75 millimeters wide at the opening the mat is 100 millimeters and is sized perfectly to go hand in hand with the dice cup and we'll look at that we'll look at the size in a second this is the thing i really love and i think it's going to come up again the essential combination will serve you well built to a high standard it will last you a long time and quickly become your favorite accessory so i don't want to put any spoilers but when we look at the quality we are definitely going to be considering the fact that these this is this is not just a random piece of equipment this is you will need if you want one you will only ever need one I think is probably the best way to go for it. So, I mean, we've got the pictures on the website. They do a wonderful job. They've got a great product photo uh, photographer. You can see all the detail. And there's two different choices, yellow and black. They're £20 a pop, but you can see all that on the website. What you can't do is use our overhead camera to have a really good look. Okay, so let's have a look at the products themselves. So we've got uh, two. We've got the black one and the yellow one. I've left this one sealed so you can see how it arrives. Now, this one will come wrapped in a very loud cellophane. So sorry for those of you listening. Uh, I know that it's making a ton of noise on the mic. But I wanted to show you how they're particularly well protected. So you've got the cellophane for this piece here. There we go. Um, and then the dice mat also comes nice and wrapped up now all of the charlie victor stuff comes in this kind of um just really well sealed plastic i think it's just part of the manufacturing process and it means that it always arrives well protected and nice condition so we've got for both of these dice cups the black one and the yellow one we've got a dice mat with a pretty awesome embossing there so charlie victor has got this little slogan okay the slogan there we go uh premium as standard now what i think it should say is unnecessarily good because that's basically how i describe all of their stuff now that is because they earn it that, that that's that's just how they do so dice mat both sides we're not here for that it's very nicely done but we are here for the dice cups so no matter where you stand when it comes to dice cups uh, this quality is outrageous so we've seen we've got the nice leather oh, oh look at this i forgot this was in them do not eat this it says you shouldn't eat it so we won't eat it it's a shame uh, anyway so nice 
nice really lovely embossed leather so this is the black one with the yellow inside so the logo here i have a difficult time getting to uh focus on but you can see there charlie victor premium standard i love the worn what's the vintage look i absolutely love it i think it's probably just my age but as I was growing up, jeans were vintage, t-shirts were vintage, and the quality of this is vintage. So nice felt inside there, but the front is where it comes into its own. You've got lovely embossing, really beautifully executed, but I, I think the thing for me that I think is really phenomenal about all of this is that this is proper leather. We've got a really nice strip around the top to keep it tidy, and the stitching is really, really nice. This is just proper i think is probably the only way to describe it this is not an empty coke can you're throwing a dice around in this is probably one of the nicest things i own <laughs> because it is just proper leather and again you've got the nice embossing there on the bottom i don't really have anything else to say this is just beautifully made like this is this is the kind of thing you would expect of top quality gear like charlie victor so that's the black one and we've also got the yellow one to look at as well and um, you know what i'm a big fan of yellow and green being a green bay packers fan and i think the yellow one is my favorite it's cool you've got kind of worn bits of leather there i mean this is this is brand new sort of brand new milton and i used it for a couple of our dungeon bowl games um he has fallen in love with them so that's quite cool as well he's like right i need to get hold of some of these but again you can see in the yellow one lovely embossing the embossing's a bit clearer great quality stitching the product itself is, is great and on the website as as you will already seen like it says this will fast become one of your favorite pieces of equipment and it's probably fair because they're a great size the quality is perfect you've got the embossing you've got the dice mat so on the size factor uh what do i have that i can appropriately use i think i'll use a beast man there we go beast man is always a good measurement of size there so this is the beast man for my beast of college team and you know it's probably three beastmen tall in the world of coca-cola it is probably that big so it's a little bit smaller than a can of coke and that is probably good size i have normal human sized hands and you know what it fits in lovely in my normal human sized hands dice go in lid goes on we shake it up we drop it down the dice come out and it's an 11 so almost double logos really good size is great and it's not too loud so this is the thing about dice cups if you get the plastic ones or the metal ones and you rattle them around like you're trying to conjure a demon that's going to upset people this however and this is something that i really do appreciate you get this that's it like there's no egregious sounds you can spin it you can roll it like this and it actually doesn't make a horrific amount of noise you drop it on the table it makes a very reasonable sound and this is really important dice cups get a bad rap because people are very loud with them and they will slam them on the table the beautiful thing about these is that they're quiet that felt lining that we've got on the inside there helps keep the sound down and when you roll it you just end up with dice sounds you can see it's nice and flat you've got the embossed side technically i think the best way to do it is to use the flat side uh, to place it on the pitch i just love this now i'm just rolling dice for the, for the sake of it so there you have it brilliant product from charlie victor the quality is as i was ever described their gear unnecessarily good if you are in the market for a dice cup that is going to be quiet that is going to do what you need to do and is going to last for probably centuries then this is definitely a purchase that's worthwhile charlie victor they are priced fairly i think is probably the best. they're not cheap they're definitely not cheap but what you do get is something that is certainly not cheap. This is just better quality than we deserve as gamers, I think is probably the best way to say it. I'm not a huge Dice Cup fan until I've seen these. And actually, the quality is beautiful. This is a quality piece of gear. And again, another massive hit by Charlie Victor. I put the links to them and their website below. If you're interested in their products, please go check them out. I have yet to see anything from Charlie Victor that isn't absolutely top quality for Blood Bowl. Best Blood Bowl bling by a mile. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. We'll be back soon with more Blood Bowl content. Happy rolling. Thanks very much for watching. We really appreciate your support. If you want to help support the channel even further, please like and subscribe or come join us on our Patreon. We have early access to content. We get loads of feedback from you guys and we try and do competitions as much as we can or 
you can get yourself some Bonehead Podcast merch on our Spreadshirt site. So if you want to support a team, especially for the Bonehead Championship, you can pick up a shirt, a mug, things like that. It all helps support the channel and we really appreciate it. Anyway, links below. Thank you very much. Happy blocking.